Alexander Walker. Here's Edwards. And he uses the glass on the lane. Edwards got the game tied up here for the Timberwolves. And it's official. They have come all the way back. At one point, this thing seemed to be out of reach. This is a testament to this team's fortitude, never giving up. Folks, we've got a new ballgame. Jackson misses. That's one he knows he should have drank. Outside, Edwards. Jackson against Morris. Six on the shot clock. Read the pass to Morris. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. And it's Jackson with the ball, bringing it up for Denver. The shot by Holiday, no good. Those are chances. Almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of it. Edwards can't hit. The Nuggets have gone one of three from the field to start the fourth quarter. Outside Holiday. Now, here's Jokic, guarded by Reed, nailed from three-point land. And the Nuggets lead by three. Exceptional playmaking there from Jokic, just seeing the gap. Morris outside. Edwards against Holland. Edwards can't hit. The Nuggets leading by three. Just under two and a half minutes gone here in the final quarter. Stolen by Reed. And Edwards with the stop. Great vision from Morris makes the next pass. That's what you want. Nuggets have gone two or four from the field since we started the final quarter of play. On the wing, Jackson covered by Morris. Here's Nelson. They get it again. Jokic. Gouging inside, it's Jokic. Yeah, boxing out Jokic is easier said than done, especially when he's sniffing out rebounds. Jackson against Morris. Here's Warren, and foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. And you know what? You allow a guy to get right to the rim like that, that's your only option. Hey, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Nuggets? And, guys, how about the unselfishness and, and all about working that ball around, shifting the defense, and just seeking out the best shot? And there's another thing going on right now for them that has to get their confidence up, and that's the three ball. I mean, it's been falling for them, and they're locked in, and that outside shot going, that's a big difference maker. Minnesota making some changes. Gobert, he's checked in for Reed. Carl Anthony Towns comes in for Alexander Walker. And Mike Conley is subbed in for Morris. Big group substitution here for Denver. Aaron Gordon, he's checking in for Najee. Porter comes in for Christian Brown. Contavious Caldwell Pope, he's checked in for Justin Holiday. And Murray subbed in for Jackson. He's a multi-talented player, is T.J. Warren, and capable of playing now both forward positions with the way the game has changed. Valuable player for what they want to do offensively. And, and won't find many more games as entertaining as this one. No, this is about as high octane a game as you're going to find. Edwards with it. Now defended by Jokic. Not just the accuracy in the quarter, it's his movement and the energy that's getting him on this nice roll. Now here's Murray. Jokic high post. For Gobert. Jokic gets it done right in front, in close. Doing a lot of nice work now from the field. He's helped get them this lead, timeout, and timeout. now he's helped them keep it. Minnesota calls timeout. Start. Daniels is checked in for Minnesota. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldridge. Hey, guys, here's what Chris Finch went over with his guys during the break. He said, look, you guys are playing physical, and I like that, but it has to be under control. We've committed way too many fouls. We've allowed way too many foul shots. Kevin? Thank you, David. 
Towns looking it over. Shot clock at six. Minnesota needs to get off a shot here. Gobert, no good. Denver leading by three. Jokic passes to Porter. Jokic kicks to Murray. Jokic against Gobert. Corner shot. Anthony Edwards with the rebound. Edwards got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. It's rebounded by Jamal Murray. Murray's got six rebounds now in the game. And there's the call on Rudy Gobert. That will get him his fourth foul of the game. Yeah, that's a tough call right there, and, and really a tough break for the D. Murray finds Porter. Denver passing it around. Caldwell Poe pass to Jokic. Five to shoot. Outside, Gordon fires the three. Wow, through the contact, and that three almost went in, so he'll go to the line for three free throws. the first of three and that gives them a four-point cushion and Gordon isn't a guarantee at the line but he knows he can do this it'll be all about focus and a tough miss as the second of three shots at the line missing one to go So he ends up making two out of three, and it's a five-point game. Yeah, we can talk about the insane dunking, but Aaron Gordon is such a great blue guy. With all the little things and willing to sacrifice his numbers for the good of the team. Edwards passes to Towns, and Towns throws it down. And this is why he's a go-to option. Towns enjoys getting the chance to come up big for his team. Murray with it. Picked up by Edwards. Jokic draws the double. There's Porter with the three. Drills the three-pointer. And the Nuggets lead by six. And guys, he's been a one-man air raid coming at them time and time again. Kind of like he's in his living room right now. He's still in the comfort zone. Once he gets that, the defense knows they're in trouble. Edwards finds Gobert. Count the bucket coming off a perfectly placed assist. Eight points for Rudy Gobert. And what, what a shot. Gobert showing he has what it takes in the play. Outside Gordon. Jokic on top for Gobert. And Jokic with the basket on the assist by Gordon. Jokic just got 31. Jokic stepping up big time here. Timeout, timeout. And the Timberwolves call time. They're trailing by six. There's 53 seconds left in the fourth. There's 53 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. The jump hook, got it! And now they trail by just four. And the more experience Edwards gets, the better he'll become, especially when he's stepping up and hitting the big shots. All well broke, gets to Murray. So they foul intentionally.
Take break. Take break. Two seconds. the first and that puts them up by five. Jamal Murray at his size the one impressive thing that stands out to me is that he will willingly go right at the defense. And so both free throws are good and it's a six point ball game. And a lead getting safer and safer as these free throws from the strike go. Time out, time out. And the Timberwolves call time. They're behind by six. 29 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. seconds left in the fourth quarter. Towns, the pass to McDaniels. Towns, a screen on court. A kick out to Towns. Pass to Edwards. Let's the free fly. It's in! What a beautiful shot to bring him to within three. And he is built to be the man for this team. Edwards answering the bell and executing. And they need to stop the clock so there's a foul no choice but to foul there but, but he's probably the last guy you want to see on the line gives them a four-point cushion. And just not the guy you want shooting the ball from the free-throw line against you. Caldwell Pope can more than hold his own. The second one is good. Hitting both at the line, and it's a five-point game. Ooh, I think that's a wrap. And I can tell you, you can't have more pressure-packed free throws than the ones that are going to seal the game. And here's Conley outside. Trains it from downtown. And there is just no fear in Mike Conley. He, he has not met a big shot he was afraid to take. Time call here. The Nuggets decide to talk it over. They're up by two. Three seconds left in the game. And there's the intentional foul. No choice but to stop the clock here. Yeah, you, you can't let him hold the ball. It's just milk those five seconds away. the first one and that makes it a three-point lead these are the moments that gets Murray going he knows how to come up big when it matters and he hits both free throws here so now it's a four-point ball game and so it's Denver who comes out on top here things were looking bleak for him obviously coming into this game but with